Ladies and gentlemen, our President and CEO, Mr. Stephen Elop. Welcome, Stephen. And so here's the man facing a mountain of expectations to turn the company around and produce something stunning from the marriage with Microsoft. We've had some difficult moments and some tough decisions to make, but in the last few months, we started to deliver some early results. There were more handsets revealed for the Asher series of budget and mid-market phones, but then came the moment that most people were waiting for. With the support of our partners and suppliers ready with the camera around the world, I am so excited and proud to introduce you to the Nokia Lumia 800. So here it was, a new smartphone to compete with any other, with a clear screen, a 5 megapixel camera, and inbuilt software services like turn-by-turn -turn navigation, a free music service, and the ability to play Microsoft games. The trick that Nokia need to pull off is to persuade sufficient numbers of people that they are not yesterday's company. They really, in this device, can take on the infamous iPhone and the range of high-end Android phones that are being sold in their millions around the world. Nokia certainly believe they can do it. It is an absolutely stunning device. And these are the words that I hear from our partners when we show it to people. They really, it's a beautiful experience. So I think we're very self-aware. We understand that this is the beginning of a new, a new era. Lumia means light, means a new dawn. So we really believe that we're confident that we're going to bring Nokia back to the position of leadership. That's it's very very, very competitive market we're in. You know, this, this is an amazing category that we're in. And today's an amazing day in that for Nokia. You know, the originators of mobile uh, telecoms. And it's a very competitive market. And it's not just us, of course. Other manufacturers spend a lot of money and we need to compete. And we're going to go very hard because we're very proud of what we've achieved with the Nokia Lumia 800. Also, the forthcoming other devices, the Nokia Lumia 710 and so on. So we're very, very excited. So newfound confidence in some interesting new products. But will it be enough to turn the company around? And Nokia has a great tradition in, and heritage in phones, and so there's a bit of a nostalgia going on there. And if you look at the design, certainly the bright pink one or the cyan one, it's, it's very different to anything that's on the market at the moment. And so I think the people that will go for it will be those sort of agitators. They'll be the people that want to be seen with something else, not want to be part of the iNorm crowd. And if they can convince enough people to do that, then they've got a success on their hands.